I'm back there helping them and potential. Do you have any statistical goals? Uh, let's just say I want to be um, the walker. That's, I just, that's what I want, and I feel like the O-line in front of me will help me get there, and from there it's just about um, just taking it slow and just taking it day to day. Um, looking back at last year, what did that run against Wisconsin mean for you personally and then for this team? Because it seemed to really seem to be the kind of the, the statement. Right. It was uh, it was great for me personally, but that wasn't what I was thinking. I was just happy for to win that game for the seniors. You know, those seniors that was uh, there last year, they didn't they had to beat Wisconsin, and we all just wanted that for them and for the team. And that's really what that's really how I felt about the run. What did you want to do this off season to get to this point? Um. Just uh, study more film, look what I've done last year, look, look what I could have done more, whether that's, whether that's uh, just getting square from on the scrimmage and not turning my shoulders so I can see everything in the um, front end, looking forward to me, and just and just working on my blocking. That's, that's pretty much it. What about like, weights and stuff like that? Did you, did you try to gain a couple of pounds? Or yes, I have been trying to gain a couple of pounds. So it's going up and down the schedule, but it's getting there progressively, but, um, slowly. But um, the, struggling, the stress down has been doing a wonderful job and helping me progress, providing me the food and resources to be able to gain that weight. So, okay. And you've got a, about a month before uh, summer workouts, so you're going to be training on the West Coast. Okay. Uh, no, nah, I'm actually, right now, after spring ball, we'll take finals, and then I'll be going home back to Atlanta, Georgia, and train there for a couple weeks, and then we'll come back here and train here. And that's pretty much it. They will go in the fall camp and get ready for the season. How has your body changed two years now? It's um, thicker to me. Yeah, <laughs> definitely got a lot thicker. Uh, I say that. Um, I feel a lot stronger. Um, then when I take contact, I feel I can feel the power that I'm exerting from my legs to my whole body. So that's pretty much it. And the stress, the stress that has been doing a great job of just taking care of my body and not just throwing loads of weight to injure myself, whether that's little joints or big muscles. So they make a good job. When you said Doug Walker, I mean, it means you need a lot of carries, right? Maybe. Uh, maybe. Maybe. I need a good amount. good amount. But <laughs> if, if it happens to be I don't get enough carries, then that's what it is. I mean, I'll be happy with whatever I get. Um, I just want to uh, do everything I can to help the team win. And, that, and if that's getting a lot of carries or if that's not getting a lot of carries, then I'm good with that. Tell me, tell me about the cool workouts that you've been on. How, how much of those kind of uh, help change you? Because I imagine right, right. those are, from the outside, it looks easier. Right. But I imagine that just absolutely pushes you. Right. Uh, Interesting fact, that was my first time doing a pool workout um, with that with my trainer. So really what I felt from that, it was just like a, it looks like a lot, but it's not. It's just, it looks like I'm working hard, but it's also just working on the ligaments, little joints uh, to help myself recover for the next workout or the next day or even the next couple weeks. So that's really the main focal point of that workout. He's been looking great. Um, he's very strong, very powerful. Um, he can run a little bit, um, but not just Gavin, but the whole running back group as a unit. You know, we've been uh, me and Avo, the older guys in the room, has been trying to help the young guys learn the playbook, get uh, acclimated uh, to seeing different type of fronts, different rotation, and back fit in the back end of the defense for protection standpoint. And they've been doing a good job and just being coachable and listening to not just us, but the whole coaching staff. And that's what's helping them a lot and progress uh, to play the game of football. If it were up to you, how 